Hello everyone, today we are doing the Leave No Survivors achievement. We're in the Dragon's Reach Part 1 episode, and we are within the Waypoint Conundrum section. Going to start by asking Scruffy to follow us. This one can be a little challenging, especially the last one, so you might want a friend, but I will be doing it solo in case you want to know how to do that as well. So you can walk through the traps or you can ask Scruffy to scan them. So our goal is to defeat 12 sets of enemies which can be found in traps. So this is our first set. And this achievement, it's all about doing everything incorrectly, but it also has to be done a correct way as well. So triggering the traps and spawning all the enemies. And it can be frustrating because if you do something wrong, you must start again. So just keep an eye that this achievement is still up here. This is now 11. The second that disappears without getting the achievement, that means you did something wrong. Our next set. If you're struggling a little bit, or you just want to kind of get through things a little faster, you can set Scruffy to a defend mode. Alright, moving forward with the story part, just a side note, this door is currently closed. It, uh, oh, we left Scruffy on defend mode. That doesn't matter so much right now, it will matter later. All right, so we are going to do this the incorrect way and just grab it. Put Scruffy to defend mode. And these oozes can be annoying as well. I've gotten caught in between them and just got tossed back and forth because that is my luck. Yeah, I'm not doing this so great now, am I? All right, set Scruffy back to follow mode. The next one that's closest is right here, but I'm just gonna trigger the trap over here just so that you can see it. You don't have to trigger the traps again. I'm just trying to do it so that you can see. Right here. Sorry, you have to trigger the traps, but you don't have to scan for them. You can just walk right into them. That makes a little bit more sense. So we're going to do this a different way. We're going to apparently not turn it on, but instructions are for chumps. So we're gonna turn off the generator, open the generator's casing, and then we're gonna select the incorrect one. We're just gonna grab for the item and go, oops. And this portal is going to spawn. Now we're gonna set Scruffy to defend mode just because these guys can be a pain. And this veteran can have this altar shield pop up that makes them invulnerable. If that's the case, your altar is right here. Just take it down. You'll be able to apply some damage again. Kind of hoping the altar would pop up so I could show you. All 
Alright, so we'll change Scruffy back to follow mode, and now we're going to do this correctly so we can progress the story. I'm going to switch it on, because apparently we didn't do that last time. That's Scruffy. Instructions are for chumps, so we're going to turn off the generator again. We're going to open the generator's casing again, but this time deactivate that field. And now we can move forward. So we're just going to grab the field right here. There's another one on this ledge, but we're going to save that one for last because it's kind of painful. It's really easy if you have another person here with you, but solo it can be challenging. Um, so when we scan this one, our next trap popped up there as well. Next one is up here. Over here, my friend. Pull some weight while we're at it. Follow mode, and now we're gonna head over to the next part of the story. And so we're gonna grab the wrong chest, move the containers, activate defense mode. This dude's gonna run at us in a way that will give you nightmares. And the wolf is pretty easy. For some reason, just takes time. Scruffy back to follow mode. We have three left. Our next one is over here. So this crate is also the one you want to interact with to get the crate scrapper achievement. And I have nothing really to help against the brick bar, but I think Scruffy's stuff is doing damage to it. So we're going to get Scruffy to follow us. Now this is, this is the challenging part. This is where it would help to have a friend. Yeah, we're not even close enough. Can you scan now? Nope. There we go. So in this trap is a veteran inquest that at 50% will start running to that door that I showed you before that's closed. So the second we trigger this trap, that door will open and our other three inquests are in that door. So the trick is trying to not lose this veteran while killing the other three. So if you had a second person, they would just wait at that door and kill those three while you handle the veteran. But we're solo. And I tried the method recommended on the wiki where I go in the trap, I don't engage 
don't fight. Scruffy is on follow and I went in and killed the other inquest. But when I came back, this inquest just kind of disappeared. So we're going to try the other way that I can think of, because I've done like different things. Nothing's working. So let's see if this works. So we're going to trigger, immediately put Scruffy in defend mode, get Scruffy to distract our veteran. Hey, over here. Yeah. You guys do your thing. Because when I didn't distract the veteran, they just disappeared. And if you kill the veteran first, this door closes. The veteran gets away, this door closes. It's very tricky tricky. So kill these dudes as fast. Okay. Okay, it kicks you out. I had a slight panic there. So Scruffy still has our veteran distracted, which is good. Oh, my goodness, we're finally going to get it. It's finally going to work. Okay, so another thing to note that they'll start running towards the door. And so you got to kill them before they get close to the door. It's even close to the door. Oh, my God, come on. They'll teleport. <gasps> oh, that was so close. I think when they get around here, they just kind of teleport in. Thank goodness I've been here all day. All day. Because I couldn't find some of the traps. I couldn't figure out some of the puzzles. And even then, I would record it and I would mess it up. And I wanted a smooth run so it was as straightforward as possible. Oh my goodness. All right. I hope that was helpful. Just so you know, it is possible to do solo. But if you want to keep your sanity, a friend might help. All right. That is it. That is everything. And I don't know. Maybe see you around.